Yo, what's going on guys? Quality Darren here today bringing you a brand new video for the channel. Today we're going to be taking a look at how you can get skins for Steam. No, not these skins, but skins that make your Steam go from looking like this to this. So it's actually a very, very easy process. Let's go ahead and jump into it. So, first thing you're going to need to do is actually find the skin you want to get. Now, what I'm going to be installing is Metro for Steam, as you can see right here. So basically, just go ahead and click download, and it'll download the latest version of Metro. If you do want to look at some other skins, feel free to do so. Just search them into Google and find one that you like, and it's the exact same process. Anyway, once you have that here, we'll just go ahead and show it in the folder so we know where it is. And it's right here in our downloads folder. What I'm going to do is basically just keep it open there. Uh, go ahead and open that up, okay? So now we're going to go down here and we're actually going to exit Steam. So just make sure you have Steam closed down or else this process won't work. So next we have to go to File Explorer. Then we need to go to this PC and we just basically need to find the Steam folder. It's most likely in Program Files x86. Scroll down until we find Steam right here. There it is. And then just scroll down again and we'll find Skins right here. Now I actually already have it put in but I'm just going to delete that for a minute and I'll show you guys how you can actually do it. So Open up that uh, file you just downloaded, it should be in your download folder, and all you need to do is drag this, fo this folder right here into the actual skins steam folder. So we'll go ahead and let it do that real quick. Okay, so it's added in there now. Also, there's a font you actually need to install, but Windows normally has that installed. But if you want to just go ahead and click into it, double click and click install there as well. But as I said, it's probably already installed, so uh, there's nothing to worry about there. Now, we just do have one more step. Okay, so once you have that done, just go to your uh, browser again and basically just put this link in. It'll be linked down description below, so all you have to do is go ahead and follow that link. But essentially, it will download a folder right here called bin. Now, this is only for the actual Metro skin. You don't need to do it for any others. Uh, this essentially just allows you to customize some of the things on it. So what we're going to do is double click this, and as you can see, we've got an executable file here. You just need to add that into the uh, skins folder as well. So as you can see here, so you go into Metro for Steam, and then you go ahead and add it in there. So. Go into the skins folder, into Metro for Steam and add that in. And then you can actually double click this and you can actually change some stuff in uh, the actual team. So really cool. You can see you can change the accent color, which is basically what highlights uh, whatever thing it is. So let's go ahead and actually open up Steam again and I'll show you how to actually uh, enable the team. Alright, so when you open Steam back up for the first time, you're probably going to be like, why is my skin not here? Well, you actually have to do one more step. Just go to Steam up the top left right here, go to Settings. And then over here you'll see interface, go to skins and choose metro for steam or whatever skin that you have just installed. Go ahead and click OK, it will ask you to restart steam. Let's go ahead and do that and then you guys can see the brand new theme on your steam. That rhymed. As you can see it has a really cool kind of loading screen right there as well which I really like. And what I like about this Metro team is that it, it looks really good on Windows 10 as well. It kind of fits with the whole Windows 10 team. And yeah, that's about it guys. You can experiment with it, have a look around. There's all sorts of different cool stuff and it just looks really, really nice. And as I said, there's lots of skins out there that you can choose from. So yeah, that's about it for this video guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it. Give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you want to see more stuff like this. Anyway guys, thanks so much for watching. I've been Carly Darren. I'll catch you guys in my next video. No.